I just want y'all to know. So when I say 90% of white subscribers on YouTube is racist, don't come at nobody and claim that they're race baiting and stuff like that. Because the truth of the matter is white racist people have a problem with you holding up their racism to society. This is why y'all try to flag certain videos, stuff like that. Anything that's revealing of your ugly ass nature, you always try to get flagged and hide from the world. But you go around secretly doing and saying comments like this. And y'all been writing comments like this for years. And for what? For somebody being fair and unbiased? Let me tell you something. If I was a white content creator, I would go through none of this shit. Everything you guys do is based off color, but you claim that you fear and you're not. There's nobody better equipped to diagnose you and talk about you than me. Because the majority of this subscriber base is Caucasian. Okay? It's flat out Caucasian. And since everybody want to talk about my subscriber base and my numbers, my numbers are a direct reflection of how racist y'all really are. Because what video did you see that got you so upset? Because it wasn't me being racist or saying anything derogatory like y'all come and bring to my comment section but y'all claim bruce is the one that's sensitive but i never get upset when y'all talk about a fighter and stuff like that you guys get upset if i say lomachenko ain't got no power you think that's a warrant for racism i watched you sit up here and racially attack a child because you thought it was mine you didn't have no you, you, you didn't have no second thought of this is a kid. Maybe I shouldn't talk to her like that. Y'all tried to say the most racist, derogatory things that you could. Then when you found out it was one of your fellow racist kid, y'all go and erase the comment. So all of a sudden, you don't want to kill this kid. All of a sudden, this kid ain't the N-word 100 miles an hour. It goes to show that you have no remorse whether you see a black adult or a small child you love being racist so fucking much that you can't help it that you will threaten a kid which is nothing new because y'all been threatening kids killing kids you know it's nothing new but the whole point is you're this upset because i won't lie this is what you're upset about and this is all y'all write about. And at the end of the day, since I'm here, let me reveal what y'all real problem is. This is their real problem. Their real problem is they don't have enough representation in boxing because their race does not dominate in this sport like black and brown. But what they don't understand is there's a lot of sports that other races don't dominate in. They don't complain. They don't bitch and they don't go around being racist. Okay. Blacks, Orientals, and all that are not dominant in hockey. Do you see them complaining about it? No. Blacks, Orientals, everybody else is not dominant in NASCAR. Do you see them complaining about it? We are not dominant in the strongman competition. But do you see us complaining about it? But when you're not on top and shown as the person of main attention, um, the shining white guy, then you have to go racist on everybody. And that's what everybody around the world has been doing. We've been documenting how retarded you act when you don't get your way. How racist you are towards people just for basic shit. And here it is. You can't even create content. And this is all y'all do. And they can't tell you, we're all not like that. Yes, they are. Because the majority of you that's not like that never speaks out against shit like this. You walk and you step over comments like this in my comment section all the time. I have never seen none of you actually take a stand on your own and even fucking denounce racism. The only thing you have done is take up and make an excuse and say somebody is race baiting because they bring up the racism that you bring to their page every single day for talking about boxing. 